What's up, everyone? Hope everyone's having a good day. I'm at Wally World. Got some mountains in the background. <clears throat> I was thinking about looking at this watch today. I don't know if I should get it or not get it, but I was thinking about it. And I don't know if I'm just a little watched out right now or should I get it for the channel? But uh, anyway, I just want to show some, some of this nice evening starting of the sunset. Some of the mountains and over there, some nice sunset. So we'll go in, see what's going on. They had a nice Timex in the glow watch with a stretch band. Yeah, it was on sale. They had a bunch of nice watches that I was thinking about. I just wanted to hold out. I just didn't want to keep buying and buying and then, you know, I just buy and buy, buy and I review it. But after that, it's just something comes along later on that I really want to get, you know, that I'm really, really might find. And there's so much things to do right now. I got to fix my car. I'm still, I'm still working on that. Some guy yesterday goes... He's trying to be helpful. He's telling me, yeah, you should put all the watches and tell them which watch you really recommend. I, I kind of did a video like that already. I mean, I could do that again. That's not a problem. I, I take anything anyone says. I, I'm still learning with this, and I take anybody has any advice, I take it. And my one video hit 10 million today. One of my older videos from three years ago, it hit 10 million today. If you want to check it out, anyone, it's two German Shepherds, one beautiful Doberman. That was my dog, Ace. Unfortunately, I lost him two years ago. He passed away on me, he was sick. But his video just hit 10 million. Anyway, Let's see what they got. Look at this. Look at this wannabe G-Shock. You believe this? Look at this. Look at this thing. Georgie Watch, whatever it is. It's in the Georgie Watch section. You believe they did this? See-through band. Nice woman's watch. But it looks like a G-Shock. It looks like a 5600. There's the Georgie Watches. Still hanging tight. Store is pretty packed too. This store, this store is pretty packed. Let's see what they got. Yeah, it's only nineteen dollars. You know, they there's the watch I'm looking to get. They they have it. It's only nineteen dollars. I could get it and review it. If I do buy it, I'll review it tomorrow. Let me debate it. You know, I looked on, uh, I looked about that watch when a couple people were talking on my channel about it, that it's a good watch. I know it's a good watch, but they have, uh, they have it in black too, which is nice with the gold, but they have it in a negative display. And my luck, I'll buy that beige band, which I like. I like that, that color. I like the whole color scheme going on there, but, uh, then I'll find it somewhere with a negative display. But it's it's a great watch. And I don't know, it says $19 on that one. I don't know why. There was two of them here. There's another one. Yeah, they both say 19, so can't be can't be wrong on that. So yeah, they got they got every every watch they usually have. No shocks can't beat this some guy uh, uh, commented on my channel oh I'm so happy you talked about that Timex shock and I found one I bought a G shock he said but then I I love that Timex it, it's just perfect it is a great watch I mean G shocks or, or the shock Timex is you can't beat either one of them you can't beat either one of them so I'm glad that he was happy I'm happy with mine I'm looking for the gray and white one now. 
there's a gray and white. Um, I actually commented to him. There's a gray and white. This is the this is the bluish with the white and the black with the Velcro band. There's a gray and white, and then there's the one that I think he said he's got the yellow. I had that one already. I brought it back to try to find this one. There's a yellowish with the gray one. There's three different ones of the shock, and they all were produced around 2017, 2016, 2017, these models, and they're still out there. You can get them on Amazon. If you don't want to go uh, look in the store, you can still get them on Amazon or eBay. So you can still get them like that. See, here's another watch I like, too. It's a negative display, but come on, look at this thing. Look at this thing in a positive display. Come on, that's crazy. Look at this. This one's in a negative display. This, uh, this is the same watch right there. These are two the same. I was talking about them the other day. This is uh, negative and positive, but they did some negative display. It's really cool. It's it's really quickly readable, and, you know, you can read it. You don't have to struggle too much, even though it's negative. It's really a nice watch. Really a nice watch. All right. So that's what's here. Expedition, couple expeditions, couple of Timex, no shocks. That crazy heart rate monitor one. That's a nice watch though. $45 they want for it. It's a nice watch. It's a nice durable Timex Iron Man. Like the Iron Man. Let's see what it says on it. Yeah, it's an Iron Man. It's a nice watch. I guess you put your finger on it, and you can tell your heart rate and stuff. Yeah, it's a decent watch. There's an Expedition. There's a regular Iron Man. Let's see. There's the Master G's. There's the G-Shock. Oh, the, the the other day I didn't I didn't see it. There was one of these for uh, thirty dollars. The the ninety fifty two. This G-Shock. Sitting in the corner in that other Walmart I go to, 9052. Great watch. I have this, just a different color. Fantastic, fantastic watch. Indestructible, indestructible watch. Unbelievably strong. It, my more, my the one I have more looks like this one, similar to this one, but I got a, I got like a material band on it which a lot of them don't have, but you could find that on Amazon. But this is a great watch, the 9052. And of course, the uh, 5600. I, there was four of them over there at that Walmart, four of them for 30 bucks. And uh, I know some people say, wow, I gotta get down to that Walmart, I gotta get over that Walmart. Yes, but the typical Walmart will sell it for $48 or $50. But if you get lucky and you go to a couple different Walmarts, you have time to drive around a little, you'll find these for like 30 bucks, sometimes $25. I found these for 25 So you got to like be patient and look around different Walmarts. There's a Tough Solar, uh, Casio. Let's see what's over here. I bet you someone finally w walked away with that. No, nope, they didn't. See, I don't know what to do because this is like $18. I don't know what to do. This this Timex, this is what I mean when you want to buy something because then you wind up buying it. This is a good buy. It's it's a little small though, this watch. But it's 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 a nice retro looking Timex. Nice uh, functions on it. And you see the date? I set that the other day. I was playing around with it. 2-7. That's today's date, 2-7. Oh, the date's still working perfect on it. The Indiglo's awesome, and it's a stretchy band. Not my type of watch, really, with this stretchy band, but it's a shame to let it go for a real good price. But 
sometimes you just got to hold off and wait and you find something you really want. But would I wear this? I'd probably wear it for a short time. I, I don't know. It's a nice watch, though. Anyone comment on that? Tell me what you think of this. They had a model like this called the T something. It's it's basically the same watch. It's it's really cool. It has that day glow to it, that old school day glow, and then it has a very strong indiglow on it. Very strong. Lights up the whole face. It's just a nice retro looking watch. Nice Timex. Anyway, that's what's here. Got some Sketcher watches for sale. They got a wannabe Fitbit, whatever it is. That's about it. There's really not too much. So I don't know if I should buy that watch. I got that one over there. I could check the price on that one. This one's a good price. I could check the price again on these. But that's, that's a pretty good steal for that watch. That's a pretty good steal. It comes with uh, that beige band. And uh, comes with that beige band. It has like a kind of beige accent going on around the top and the bottom of it. But it's a nice watch. The Timex nice. This is nice. And this one's nice. Well, either one of these you can't go wrong. Look at that negative display. Look at that. Unbelievable. Let's get them close together and this video. And uh, I'll see if I do get it. If I do get it, I have to look at some stuff in the store. If I do get it, I'll do a review on it tomorrow. Everyone, peace out. Have a great evening. Thank you for watching. I appreciate all the new subscribers and all the people that are on there now looking at these videos and checking them out. And if they help anyone, I hope so. Anyway, have a great evening, everyone. Peace out.